Y aquí estamos en vivo de Latino Bote TV con Hidi Yamagishi y Don Rich Gaspari, el padrino de culturismo clásico. Uh, first Arnold Classic winner, right? Yes, first Arnold Classic winner, three time Mr. Olympia. Uh, I won the Lifetime Achievement Award uh, at the Arnold as well. I don't know what kinds of accolades, I forget. Una excelente historia de culturismo. Primer ganador de Arnold Classic, tres veces Mr. Olympia, CEO de Gaspar Nutrition. Now, I know you've been with this company for a while. How many, cuantos años llevas con la marca? Uh, I started Gaspar Nutrition back in 1998. So I started it basically after I retired from bodybuilding. I, I had an injury which basically herniated a disc in my neck which took me out of competition. So when I had my gym, I started having personal training clients. I started Gaspari Nutrition and started selling my products to my clients and then built it up from there little by little. It took about five years before then I was known as a brand. Okay. In the year 1998, hizo la marca propia Gaspari Nutrition. Ya tuve que ya descansar de culturismo después de tanta victoria, pero tenía una lesión en el cuello de un disco y decidió, ¿sabes qué? Voy por el punto de negocio, el punto comercial de esta industria. Entonces, desde ahí, entre cinco años, la marca iba creciendo, creciendo, bombeando más hasta una marca leyenda global, esta marca. Now, I just talked to you a couple days ago after that big 212 victory, unquestionable victory too, in the 212 class. Congratulations, Cide. How are you feeling about that? Thank you very much. It's kind of hit me right now. When I talked to you, I, it wasn't hit me yet. But now I feel I'm, I won. Sí, ahora apenas se están dando cuenta porque después cuando hicimos la entrevista en Arnold Classic todavía no estamos muy conscientes. I imagine just a little underhydrated, right? You're just. Yes, and uh, of course, you know, it wouldn't happen without this guy, Rich Gaspari. I've been with Gaspari since uh, 2009. So me, Hide, and Gaspari together, never, never separate. I really appreciate it. Absolutely. Nunca se han separado dentro seis años. Lleva con la marca Gaspar Nutrition. Un respaldo total a una marca que le ha ayudado a rendir más y más entre los años. Una sinergia increíble entre marca y atleta. So, just, I just translate over. My next question is, what's next after winning the Arnold? You're going to be in the Olympia, I imagine, right? Of course, Olympia. It's, you know, I can see the top now, so uh, I'll be ready. Dice que ya ve él encima, ya está llegando al tope de su carrera. Nadie le va a detener. I want to say, like, like Hide said, when I sign my athletes, I look for athletes that I feel we can work with and grow like a family. When I had Hide, you know, he was just one of the, you know, the Japanese bodybuilders, pro, and I watched this guy go into show after show, uh, you know, into the big events. He's been in the Olympia getting, you know, top 10 in the Olympia. When the 212, um, category came about he asked me can I go into that category and of course then he started going into the 212 category and from there the rest is history I'm very proud of this guy to be able to go from you know placing in shows to now winning one of the big biggest shows the Arnold Classic that I won yeah una historia entre ganador primer ganador Arnold Classic hasta este año 2016 una tradición entre marca y atleta también Rich dice que Gaspari Nutrition is como una familia. We understand that word, familia, right? Entre atleta y marca. Él no le gusta dejar sus atletas al lado. Le gusta integrar sus atletas, apoyarle a uh, su atleta hasta llegar al nuevo, nuevo nivel, ese próximo nivel, especialmente entre el cambio cuando Hide competías en el open way, el clase abierto antes, before, y hizo el cambio a 212 y le quedó como un anillo, perfecto. That was just like a perfect transition crossover for you. Now, there was a little rumor that you said you want to go back up in the open, or is that just a rumor? Well, it's just a rumor for now. I don't know about future, but now I'm, I got to focus on Olympia. Absolutely. Dice que es un rumor por ahora, quien sabe en el futuro, pero ahora se tiene que enfocar en el Mr. Olympia. Okay, now Hide, where can people follow you on the social media bit, where they can get awesome nutritional tips from like Aspire Nutrition, personal recommendation and motivation for you and other great things? Well, I have Instagram, Facebook, everything, so follow me. I update my nutrition plan with Gaspari Nutrition. Everything else training, everything is here, there. Okay. All right, perfect. Any uh, last shout-outs for everybody? Well, without you guys, 
we won't be here. So uh, support me and uh, thank you for everything. And also look for the new Gaspari coming out for 2016. We're very excited with a lot of new products coming into uh, the pipeline for Gaspari. You're going to see a whole new Gaspari coming now. So I'm very excited about it. New athletes that were going to come out, keeping guys like Hide and other people where you're going to see the brand come to another level. Busquen la marca en GasparriNutrition.com, right? GasparriNutrition.com. GasparriNutrition.com, or you can go to Rich Gaspari, my Instagram, my Facebook. Van a revelar muchas sorpresas entre productos muy novedosos, muy, muy potentes. Siempre ha tenido una tradición de productos muy innovadores. You've always had kind of a tradition of innovative products. I remember Plasma Jet, Super Pump, uh, Novadex. We're coming back. We got Plasma Jet coming back. We actually have Halodraw coming back. We have some really cool products that I can't even talk about that are coming back into the pipeline that are going to be totally different, that are going to be mind-blowing in the industry, and we're going to take the industry back to, you know, take it by storm. Okay. Regreso, la revancha con Gaspar Nutrition. I have one last favor to, go ahead. No, I just wanted to say. Numero uno, right? <laughs> yeah. I, I, I have one last favor. We always say something in Spanish, never surrender, right? Yeah. It's a double meaning because Nunca Te Desvencido is also arm wrestling. Yeah. It's a bodybuilding lifestyle. It's kind of like an arm wrestling match, like over the top, Sylvester Stallone. And sometimes you feel like you're going to give up, but you need that extra motivational mental place where you got to be at just to take it over the top. So we always say Nunca Te Desvencido, never surrender. I want to hear that in Japanese. Oh, I don't know. I don't never know. surrender. Never surrender. The Never surrender. I will say, Akiramenai. One more time for that? Akiramenai. All right. Nunca te desperdicido. Hasta la próxima. Ciao.